All right. Um, uh, my name is Sumit. Uh, let me start with a quick experience. Uh, anybody, anybody who is uh, differently able sitting in this room? Anybody who cannot hear or cannot speak or who is who's uh, who's paralyzed? Okay. So let's let's have a let's have a quick quick uh, ten second of an experience where I'm I'm going to make you a differently able person in a very simple a very simple just manner, which is uh, you'll not be able to hear. Okay, for 10 seconds. All right. What I want to do is just take your thumbs. Just take your thumbs. All right. It, it's it's a it's a pretty cool thing. Just take your thumbs and put it inside your ears. All right. I'm going to run about 10 seconds on my screen, and what you're going to do is just keep it hard for 10 seconds, and then we'll have, we'll talk about this. All right. So your time starts now. All right, all right, all right, all right. Ten seconds sounds uh, looked so 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 long, right? This is a life and hearing impaired person. Some of you would have heard some murmurs from here and there. Some would, some of you must would have would have heard some voices. Some of you must have heard your own gastric juices if you've had a heavy meal. If somebody gave a fart, you would have heard a bomb. This is a life of a hearing impaired person who can hear himself more than the other people. Right. Uh, three years back, I started my journey uh, as a part of as a part of um, as a social entrepreneurship program uh, in SPJ in Bombay. I spent two months with all these hearing impaired people. So what I used to do is I used to travel with hearing impaired people in the morning. So rather than going by my own bike or my dad used to drop me sometimes, I used to go in a small ambulance like this, which used to be a typical Maruti van or a Qualys car. So they were all hearing impaired people on, in this group. So I, as a person, I'm a very communicative person. I like to collaborate. I like to talk for sure. Three days passed. I, I I couldn't I couldn't I couldn't give any gesture to them. Only thing is I could see them here in sign language. I learned thank you. I learned few words. I learned A B C D in the four days. But the fifth day, I I thought I need to connect. So I picked up a phone out of my pocket and typed an SMS. Hi, my name is Sumit, and showed it to the next guy who was sitting to me. He picked up the phone and he he typed a message back. Hi, my name is Deepak, and I'm English teacher. I said, Wow, what if we given every hearing impaired person an old donated mobile phone so that they can he can sms and connect to the world a typical mba project i was so excited about the idea i gave away phone to about 10 people i had to collect I, I collected about eight different phones from different people two of the phones i had to buy so what we did is i picked up another phone this is the first phone which i bought from my pocket it was 1200 rupees a samsung phone that time I took it back because I bought it. So what we did is we gave it to all these people, and I could see an IQ increase from 65 to 95 over a period of three months of time. Because if we are hearing impaired people, me and this pretty lady sitting out there, if we're both hearing impaired people, we just do sign language. That's it. There's no information coming out. And this old gentleman sitting next to the lady, he is a professor or a teacher. He's also hearing impaired. Unfortunately, in India, all the children are being taught mainly by the hearing impaired professors. So neither he has heard trains chuk chuk how he's going to explain to me. So I thought it's a communication device. Give it to people. So increase in IQ. Two of the girls became national level classical dancers because they got connected with somebody from outside. Somebody came and talked to them. They, they exchanged SMS. Right now, these people are about 16 number, which is in the first pilot project which we're running. Past three years, it's running successfully. And they send at an average of 110 SMS every day. Three years down the line, now what we are giving is we're giving them a nice QWERTY keypad phone. A QWERTY keypad phone is a $20 phone or a 1200 rupees phone approximately. And QWERTY keypad is the same as a laptop. We tell them, guys and girls, we'll give you teaching. QWERTY keypad phone is a learning device in your hand. We'll give you an Oxford certified typing course with Oxford certified books. Why don't you learn typing? And if you learn typing, we give them jobs in companies like travel.com, etc., which, which were travel based online websites. You can go to these websites, there's a help desk button at the top if you must have seen. We can put these hearing impaired people in replying to queries of the people. Because best schools in India are teaching them pot making, are teaching them book binding, are teaching them. Candle making, which is past, which is like 30 years old. 
So we tell them, guys, let's give these kids to us. I'll give them a three months of level by level pro program from preparation of basic grammar to high level corporate business English and give them jobs in companies like Make My Trip, etc, etc, etc. And we started with this idea and we went ahead. And uh, this is this is a few of our kids. Um, this is a few of our volunteers talking to them. You can see the expression on the face. People are ex ex because mobile is uh, it's a learning device, but we all become kids when we start using it. We check Facebook, we check, we check WhatsApp. Uh, these are a couple of our kids. Okay, this is Shahid. Um, uh, Shahid is one of my first uh, persons, uh, one of the first beneficiaries in one of the one of the schools called Dongri School, which is a rehab center. Shahid's got a very bad history, not going much into details, but but we train him for three months. He's graduated from the school, 12th standard, now he's 18 years plus. The last SMS which he typed, or the last message he showed to me was just happy. And this, I, I, I'm not sure you can read that, but, but I clicked this picture. There was, there was like a moment when a guy who is improved, who can type, who is gonna be a pot maker or a carpenter, is gonna get a white collar, 15,000 rupees per month job, was my whole idea. Right now, in India, we are India's first technology-based NGO. Out of the 20 lakh odd NGOs, we're the first one. We've got, uh, we got Oxford certification, we've got World Education Summit Award, Vodafone has empowered us, we've got Digital em Empowerment Award. Apart from that, the most important thing is, every time if you see a hearing impaired person, people don't know that, that's a basic technology of SMS. If you give him a phone with a 100 rupees recharge in that, he can start SMSing and change his world and getting jobs. We have empowered 550 odd kids in India already. We're a part of curriculum of 13 hearing impaired schools. Every Wednesday and Friday morning, first four hours, we teach them technology because this is the way they talk, they communicate. I've got a thought for you. That's my own thought. People talk about cutting edge technology. People talk about thinking outside the box. I said, guys and girls, please think inside the box. They're all cut corners inside the box if you see, if you see deep dive. And there's a lot of leeway which you can improve, which you can innovate. So innovation is not out of the box. SMS is a 30 years old technology. It's good to go on app, it's good to go on talking toms, it's, it's good to have WhatsApp, but an SMS and an old phone and an old donated phone can definitely change the life of the people. My humble request, next time you receive an SMS for a hearing from a hearing impaired person, please do reply. This is the only way he communicates, it's the only way he improves, and he's gonna get the world changing because 10 million people in India are hearing impaired. Six million people are jobless. If he can train them, they're gonna be contributing to India's economy and the GDP with a strong work group, work group, pe group people for sure. That's what I have, thank you so much guys.